displays and if my eye makeup looks a little funky and like not on point I mean it never is but even more so it's because I just got done taping my battle of the makeup eyeshadow video of Mac versus L'Oreal so I will link that video below so you guys can go and check it out and cast your vote but this video is a very exciting to me swatch pit of this collection now this um collection it's from Shaney and it is their wanted ones 12 piece lip gloss set and this is what these beautiful babies all look like and this was suggested for me to review by I don't know if she is a blazer or if she just came across my uh, Shaney beauty book review um, but this is going to be a first impressions and a lip swatching video on this set in particular she wanted to know what my opinions were on this set and I told her I did not purchase it but I did get very interested to see what it was so I did purchase this I don't remember how much I paid I will uh, link this in the description box below and I will type up the price up here in the video I did buy this on Amazon and with all Shaney products I get I always get this little orange envelope that has a little thank you note in it and it says free gift on the back of it which looks like a tube of perfume which personally I cannot wear because migraines but I might just get the free gift to put in a giveaway and I as I'm reading inside it does say that I can um, s like swipe for a different like store credit or something like that on the actual Shaney website so I will look into that and let you guys know but so without further ado let's get into the swatch pit one quick thing before we get into the swatch pit since it is about almost a hundred degrees where I live currently which is weird because like on, over the weekend it's Wednesday and over the weekend we had a blizzard it's just the way where I live works um, so I'm extra sweaty today and I cannot stand sweat if you guys know me sweat is like my worst enemy It's like disgusting to me, but I wanted to point out this which really does help um, To keep in your bag or if you you know record videos like me and you get a little sweaty and you're wearing makeup I like to put this in my bag because when I go out, you know Sometimes my makeup will smudge around but I did have to apply this just now and it's really good. It's only $4.99. It's the Wet n Wild Fergie um, Take On The Day Mattifying Powder. And it is just a mattifying powder. There was a brush in here, or a sponge, that is just translucent, as you can see. And it really does help get you looking a little bit nicer. So um, I would definitely recommend this if you guys have that problem. So now let's get to the swatch pit. So I'm just gonna go down the line. This first one is called Alter Ego. And it looks like this. Remember, keep in mind these are lip glosses. These are not matte lip glosses. They are just regular lip glosses. So here's the first one. number two blind date and remember Shaney is a cruelty free brand so this is number two hi Papa Blaze say hi it's always interrupting me this is number three charming one At the end of the video when you're done watching let me know down in the comments which ones are your favorite which ones you guys think look best on me personally I like to know your guys's opinion duck face number four first and last Number five, lover. Number six, 
Number six, Lustful. Number seven, one and only. Number eight, soulmate. Oh my God. Ugh. Number nine, spell. Just whack my nose with it. Yeah, that's fine. Number ten, sweetheart. Number 11, True Love. And finally, number 12, Wild One. Okay, so my overall view and first impression of these, I'm not very impressed with these at all. Um, they're not terrible. Um, there's not much pigment to them, and with a lot of them, I would not be able to tell the difference in which one was which. Um, I must say, to get there's like barely any product in them whatsoever. To get any product out of them, I had to keep going in and out, in and out, and scraping to get it. Um, the colors on the tubes are kind of very, um, very misleading. They don't like, especially this one, it's like it does not come out that color at all. Um, I think that in the makeup society we have been a little bit spoiled as of the past couple years with matte lip glosses and matte lipsticks and pigmentation and everything and these are more like back in the day kind of lip glosses where it's just like gloss tinted glossy gloss and that's what it was um, I do like the shimmeriness that does come off of them um, Overall, I say about, I'd give this maybe two and a half or three Wicked Little Devils. Um, would I recommend them? Maybe. If you like lip glosses, then yeah. And if you're on a tight budget and you're a beauty on a budget like myself, then yeah, I would recommend these. Um, they smell very nice. I love the fact that they are cruelty free. I always, when I try, when I'm looking for makeup, I always try to find cruelty free makeup, even though a lot of times it's very difficult to do so. And when you do, they're very expensive. So whenever I can pick up Wet n Wild or Shaney or Clean Color or Santi or any of those other ones that are cruelty free, I do try to do that. Um, I don't know if I mentioned the packaging, I do think is very, very cute. I do like the little tube, but what reminds me, is it just me or does it remind you of blood vials? I don't know. So that would be probably my overall opinion and first impression of these. So if you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments below. Let me know which ones were your favorite, if you can even tell. Um, let me know your opinions. Let me know which ones you think look best on me. If you can even, like like I said, tell a difference. Um, don't forget to go and click on my face or press the subscribe button to subscribe right now. I've always got beauty related contests, giveaways, and raffles all free going on all of the time. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias. And until next time, peace, love, and stay wicked.